ACT Math, test number five, part two of the answer key. So we're looking at question number 22. The admission to Carnival Night at middle school is three bucks. So you pay three just to get in. There are many different games and they all cost the same. Which of the following is the price of a single game? So what they're asking you to do is look at this graph and figure it out. You paid three bucks to get in, so that's three bucks right there. And then, after you've played six games, you paid about $21. So, six times X plus the three dollars equals 21. Six X equals 18. X equals three. Now, I'm guessing there. I'm not sure. But, let's take a look. I paid three to get in. I play one game, six. Another game, nine. Another game, 12. Another game, 15. Yeah, it looks like three is going to work. It's a little bit of a deliberately vague problem. I don't like that, but I get it. Figure below shows a right triangle with a hypotenuse 18. How long is leg A? Well, this is a 30, 60, 90. 60 goes up here, 90 here. 30 is what I call the short side. The short side will be half of 18. Done. The long side will be 9 root 3, but we don't even need that. When five consecutive odd integers that are each greater than 35 are added, what is the smallest possible sum? So they're saying take 35 plus 37 plus 39 plus 41 plus 43. Now you could crank all these in your calculator, or you could recognize that these are both four away from 39. These are both two away from 39, so it's really five times 39, which is 195, I believe. And you can just blast me in your calculator, that's fine too. Number 25 is shown below a 33 foot ramp. Forms an angle of 21 degrees at the ground, which is horizontal, which is the following is expression for the unknown side of the triangle. So we call this x, and we look at it, we say that'll be cosine of 21 equals x over 33. I want to get x alone, I multiply both sides by 33. 33 cosine of 21. If 2x plus 17 equals the absolute value of 35, then x equals 2x plus 17 equals 35. Subtract 17. 2x equals 18. x equals 9. Marianne once went to the local market to purchase some fruit. Each box of oranges sold for 3 and each box of pears for 5. Purchased a total of 18 boxes of fruit. So oranges, which I can't use, so I'm going to have to call it R for oranges, plus P equals 18 boxes. 3R plus 5P equals 68. Going to have a lot more oranges. Um, so we want oranges, so let's go with negative 5 times everything. Negative 5R plus 3R is negative 2R. These will cancel, and negative 5 times 18 is negative 90, is uh, 22, negative 22. 5 by negative 2, we get r equals 11. So that's what we call a system of equations problem. Notice I didn't use O, it just looks too much like 0. 28, triangle below, what's the measure of? W plus X plus Y plus Z. Well, if you just look at this triangle, you know W plus X equals 180 minus 55. And if you look at the whole triangle, you know that Z plus Y equals 180 minus 55. Add them together, and you will get 250. I like to actually block out a whole thing and then look at the triangle that way, or block out a whole thing and look at the triangle the other way. That way I can see what I'm doing. The diameter D of the rubber hose manufactured by a certain company must satisfy the inequality. What is the maximum diameter such rubber hose may have? Well, D minus 4 is less than or equal to 0 0.002, or D minus 4 is... 
Negative d minus 4 is less than or equal to 0 0.002. Multiply by negative, I get d minus 4 is greater than 0 0.002. d is greater than or equal to add 4. 4.002 over here. Add 4. Oh, that's supposed to be negative. So that's wrong. 3.998. Over here, I get d is less than or equal to 4.002. So that's the maximum diameter it may have. Make sure you read the full question. Area of a trapezoid is 32 square feet. Whenever I get one of these problems, I draw my trapezoid like this so I can divide it easily in two triangles. Um, area is 32, and that's going to be the box plus the triangle. Uh, the two parallel bases measure 3 and 4. 5, 3, and 2. What's the height? So, call the height h, and it's 3h plus 1 half, 2h. Cancel, cancel. 4h equals 32. h equals 8. Check it out. 8 times 3 is 24. 8 times 2 is 16 divided by 2 is 8. 32 is right. In the standard xy coordinate plane, A has coordinates and B has coordinates. R is the midpoint. What's the midpoint of adding them together? So the midpoint is negative 2 plus 8 over 2, comma, 7 plus negative 3 over 2 is 3, comma, 2. Add them together, get 5. Local fitness club swimming pool, start on level ground, this is what it looks like. Whenever you see a diameter, immediately turn it into a radius. Five feet high, blah, 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 blah. The nearest cubic foot, what's the volume of the water that will be in the pool when it's filled with water to a depth of four feet? Volume equals pi, ten squared, four. Volume equals 400 pi. Which is 4 times 3.12, which looks like it's going to be right about there. Put in your calculator if you want, but I can do that one in my head. Solar cover is made for the pool. We'll cover rests on the top. Include a wedge shaped flat form at a 30 degree angle. So if we sewn along one side, so this is 10. Now we've got to figure out what this is. Well, it's 30 over 360 times 2 times pi times 10. Got to crank all this out. I got one twelfth of two times pi times ten. I actually need a calculator for this, even though I think I know what the answer is. I'm not going to mess around. I get about five point two, which really, if you look at it, that's about right since this whole thing's to scale. Pretty darn close to 15. Hose connected to hydraulic pump was used to fill the pool. Pump had been on the medium setting and then went into a higher setting. It was then filled. What's your relationship shows it? Well, it was getting greater over time. So it's definitely not G. Definitely not J. Definitely not K. So the question is, was it getting... Going up and then slower, or going up and then faster? And that's going up and then faster. Slope is just a rate of change. For all non-zero y and z, go. Y to the times 10 to the negative fourth would be um, the same. 1, 2, 3, 4 as this one. They cancel, and you get 1. Z times 10 to the sixth would be the same. They cancel, you get 1. What is the median of the following nine test scores? They're not in order, so line them up. 81, pi. 81, pi. 88, 89, pi, bye. 92, 94, 95, 92, 94, 95. 2, 94, 95, 97, 100, 97, 100, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 92. 
which of the following radian measure is equivalent to 810. To convert from radians, multiply by pi over 180. Eight ten. Eight ten over one eighty. Four point five pi. So Lena has a garden in the backyard shaped like a right triangle. Yeah, right. Um she has a bag of fertilizer. Covers three hundred square feet. The area of this triangle is one half times 60 times 144, which is 4320. Take that and divide by 360 square feet, and I get I need 12 bags. Got to multiply by 5.99. Seventy-two-ish dollars. Now I know that this triangle also has a leg of one fifty-six because I did sixty squared plus one forty-four squared square root. So she wants to put a fence around her garden, and she needs a perimeter, which I just said. Oh yeah, I know that plus one forty-four plus one fifty-six, she equals three sixty. The angle opposite the 60 foot side of the fence, whoops. Angle opposite the 60 foot side of the garden measures approximately 26.4 degrees. So he wants to change the shape of the garden. She still wants this 144, but she's going to extend the 60 foot side until the angle is 37 degrees. So, how much would she have to extend it? So we need this, and then we've got to subtract off 60. This is tangent of 37 equals x over 144 multiply 144 and we get about 98 subtract 60 and we end up, pardon me, 108 we end up with 48 There it is. Had to check. What is the point? That's the center. Well, we don't care about this. We just want the center. That's negative 6, 9. Because you flip the signs. So B. And Brendan's average score is a 78. He gets a 93 in the fifth. <clears throat> What's his average weight? 78 plus 78 plus 78 plus 78 plus 93 divided by 5. We get 81. Check it if you want. Notice I wrote his four tests were 78, because that's what it's like to have an average of 78, like you got 78 on four straight tests. That's it for now. Good luck.